Hi, I'm Michael McCullough. I'm from Cleveland, Ohio, and I work in the media of glass and sculpture specifically. I was a farm kid, but I, I knew I didn't want to be a farmer. I went away to art school to study at the Cleveland Institute of Art, class of 87, and I discovered glass there. I knew I wanted to be a designer of some sort. I thought I would become an industrial designer, but I wanted to be hands-on with the material. So I chose glass as my major, and that's what I've done professionally ever since graduating. I build molds out of graphite that I then blow the glass into to make the sculptural forms that I can either make them into a standalone piece or cut those up into smaller pieces to make larger compositions combined with a metal structure to hold the glass and to be able to present it in these larger compositions. The glass, if it were just clear glass in form only, it wouldn't have the interest. People respond first to color. We all do that, whether what we're wearing for the day or what car we drive or what artwork we decide to put in our home. And then from there, the content, the imagery, um, people read into that next. As many people as there are working in the media of, of this particular material, there's a different expression. And that can really be said about those others too. What other materials can you see through? You can, you can look through these blown forms and see those cast patterns on the other side of that blown form. Um, and when light hits it, it lights up, it comes to life. It's a very challenging material to work with. There's huge technical hurdles you have to overcome to become comfortable or competent at it. And here, 30 plus years in, I, I, every time I'm in the studio, I'm learning something more about it. So it, 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 it's a never-ending process, the learning and building and evolving the work.